what I want to do is just the fundamentals of pressing, and part of um, the philosophy of the JTBs for the years that I've been doing it is a defensive system that um, disrupts, change-ups, um, because if we look at the style of play that we've got, the type of athletes that we've got, we don't have big monsters, so we've got to do something different. So we have a big philosophy where we're disrupting all the time and changing our defence all the time, and we use the pressing systems um, to do that. The pressing system that I use is one that um, Coach Jeff Green uses, and he stole it from America. So most of the stuff that we get, we're looking overseas all the time, or we're looking at some of the stuff that we're doing in New Zealand and adjusting it. So we have three pressing systems that we use, um, and it's all dependent on where the ball is scored. So we, ha we have a white, we have a black, and we have a green, and we have some very strict rules about how we do the pressing. What we've shown here um, over the last two nights is white and green. Okay, we haven't shown black because we haven't taught the boys black yet because it takes a little bit of time to teach the presses. And what I'm going to go over is just some of the fundamentals of our half-court press because that's our bread and butter press. Um, the presses are all different. So white, the full-court one, is our stealing, our disruption, our up-tempo. Black is our big man press. And green or skinny, and you'll understand why we call it skinny, is our half court or containment press. It's all about shot clock. It's all about what's happening in the first eight seconds of defense, what's happening in the second eight seconds of defense. And what we know, if we can hold a team to get to stay out of their offensive system at the 14 second, we're doing some good work. So we're looking at the 14 second mark. Um, I talked about where the ball is scored, white. Lay up, rim. It's quite easy to go into a ceiling press. Black, mid shot, mid range shot, and skinny is our three point shot. Um, some of the keys: one, understanding where the trap zones are. Three, know the three key areas to defend. The three key areas to defend are short middle, deep middle, and sideline. So. If I'm doing skinny or the green, okay, trap zones here, short middle here. Yep, deep middle here, sideline. Okay, we have to allow something. So what we allow, back pass or the lag pass or sideways pass. Those are the two passes we allow. We'll also allow a long diagonal pass. And the reason we allow the long diagonal pass, easy to close out on a lot of time. So some of it's about defending, short, forcing, long. So passes we allow, back, sideways, long diagonals, because we can rotate out of that. Um, things that, when I'm teaching it, is one, know the rotations out of it. And we'll have a look at that today the angle that they come at the trap. Remember, it's a containment press if it's a green. Okay, no middle. And get second and third traps. And most of the presses that I've watched um, a lot in New Zealand is they'll get a first trap. We don't go for the second and third trap. It's the second and third trap that are the disrupting traps. So that's how we get out into the, uh, the second and third traps. Okay, trap zones. The three... Three sets of trap zones. Okay, the reason I brought the boys in front is um, often when I teach or coach, um, and I always, I always have a whiteboard, and I always like to write up what I'm going to do so that my players understand what I'm trying to get in the training that day. If not, generally, I'll tell the players. These are the three things we're going to work on today. Okay, so let's have a look at it. Okay, let's get the boys on baseline, please. Let's hustle up. Okay, we need a basketball. Cool. Okay, and we're just going to pretend. So we want a defensive player here, please. And then I want a defensive player at half court. So we're doing our green. Okay, in line with the elbows. We like our big on the ball. We like a big in the second line. One of our guards, a three-man at the back, and another guard. 
Okay, so the guy with the ball, got the ball, step on court, just back a little bit, let's get in stance, let's get in stance. Okay, heads, I'm ready. Okay, we're just going to pretend you're like big dummy, and so you're just going to go this way anyway. But generally, if he steps on court, just wait, we'll allow him to dictate, but we haven't got the other guys, so you're going to push him. He's going to come. So bring him down. Okay, your job is to keep him sidelined. Just keep him sidelined. Wait, bring him down. Where's the trap zone? Guys, show me where the trap zone is. Kind of, where, kind of here, or, and where else can it be? Great. Okay, so we can understand that. Go back again. Okay, so let's go. Bring him on. Stay away. Here's the tape. Wait, wait. Bring him into the trap zone, you, you big dummy. Remember, ready? Bring him down. You're coming across. Ready? Go get him. Okay, stand. This is not a stealing trap. Okay? Put the ball up, put the ball up. Hands up. Put it in their hand. Do not, no, no, not a stealing trap. Okay? Just stand. Okay, angle of the trap. Feet together. You can't see over that side. We should have gone the other side. Sorry. Where should your foot be? Awesome. Why do you think it should be there? Yeah. Because if your foot's closer, go, take it away again, move it away from the sideline, and you go there and he does that, what are you going to get? A foul. Awesome. Okay, let's try that again. We'll go that side. So all those people over there that are looking. Okay, here we go. Go. Wait. Hands up. Hands up. Wait. Go. Wait. 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 Go get him. Good. Good job. Stand straight. Stand straight. Good job. Is your foot on the sideline? <laughs> awesome. Yeah, it was just. Okay, so I want to get my foot on the sideline or across the sideline. Okay, and get him into the trap zones. If we get him in the front, in the back half of the court, we're using shot clock. We're thinking eight seconds. Okay, we want to hold. We want to get, put him under a little bit of pressure because now he's got to make a pass. Which pass is he allowed to make? A lag pass. Okay, that's the one. You can make a lag or a sideways pass. Okay, rotations are offense, because we're just going to do a little bit of practice of this, guys. Okay, offense goes to the middle. Middle goes to the sideline or half court. New offensive player in. Got it? Let's do it both sides. Here we go. Set it up. So we have half the lines there, half the lines here. So offense goes to the middle defender. Middle defender goes to the sideline defender. Sideline defender gets out. Ready? Go. Just keep him there. Wait. Angle. Wait. Don't go and attack him. Go get him. Good. Stop. Good job. Rotate. Go. Feet on the sideline. Okay, this is big. You don't have to go get them. We're not, it's just, we're keeping the ball down the sideline. So our bigs are right here. Don't let them middle. No middle. Okay, we don't have to go get him. And then suddenly, coach will call. And some of the reasons um, Coach Green is standing there, and I do it a lot, and Coach Lawrence. So just if we turn around, they're my two um, technical advisor, Coach Green, and assistant coach Lawrence. Um, and you'll hear us yelling it, wait, wait. Okay, part of that is build the pressure on the opposition. Because they're going, even the best handlers are like, oh, damn, it's a press. And it's amazing how when we do it at training and we say, okay, it's just a drill, it's just a drill. In a game, it's amazing how many times they go to the spot you want them to go. So here we go. Let's work on it. Be aggressive. Push them there. Push them there. Keep saying, wait. Have a look. At it. Wait. Hands up. Hands up. Hands up. Go get it. Good job. Cool. Get your foot on the sideline. Rotate. Let's go. Next one. Sprint to the rotations. Go. Wait. Wait. Okay, okay, potentially not a great trap in that one because you, know, you might just be able to throw it over the top. <laughs> it's a little bigger. Rotate. <laughs> Here we go. Wait, wait. Keep it on the sideline, keep it on the sideline. Good. Go get him. Good job, guys. Here we go. Couple more. Pretty simple. Go. Good job. Okay, come on back. So let's look at the rotation. So let's put another defender in. So we have a guy in the middle, two guys lying with the elbows. That would be now if we could possibly have that. One in the middle, 
line with the elbows just below the halfway line. Let's go. Yeah. You, you can't get it wrong, only I can get it wrong. You get it wrong, it means I've, I haven't done my job. Okay, one guy on the ball. So, and one guy in. So let's just say you're the guard. Your handler? Cool. Okay, let's just say, ball goes into the guard, you've got to stay behind, all right? You've got to stay behind, so you're going to be the lag pass. So let's go, go get the trap. Here we go, wait, wait, wait. Okay, what did we say? Stop there. What did we say on the board that you have to defend? What area in the court? Outstanding. Short middle. Okay, so you now have to turn your arm, oh, sorry, your backside to the corner, and you're here looking. Why am I looking here? This is what I'm doing. What are you protecting? Where do people want to throw? What does coach tell you when a press is on? What does every coach yell out? Get the ball to the middle. You want to break the press. So we want to keep it out. So your job, if they've gone over there, your job is to defend short middle. And where is it? So my butt is right here. I'm defending short middle. Yep, waiting for someone to come in. If they come in, I'm going to get them. So let's go trap there. So you're defending short middle. Where's your backside facing? Okay, stop. Okay, throw a leg. Just come up down a little bit, honey. Okay, rotations out. This is the handler. Go handler. Yeah. Okay. Can you see the ball? Yeah. No. No, Can you see the ball? Okay, very good. Okay. Your job, take the player. Okay? That's the handler. We don't want him to make a pass and then cut straight back. Because it's going to kill the press. Because where's the ball going to go? Middle. Straight to the middle. Cool. So take him out. What do you think your job is? Right there, You're going to sprint over there. Okay, do you think, where, where are you going to sprint to, though? Middle. To the middle? To which, which spot? Where he was. To the, the closest circle. Yeah. Okay, how does he know? So I'm going to come out. What's your job now? Okay, you've still got to protect the middle. So I'm still protecting the middle. Start dribbling. We, no, no, let's go this way. Okay, go. Where are you coming? To the ball, to the circle below the line of the ball. When can I go? Yeah, you've got to release me. I can't go to them, because what will they do? They'll go bang, straight back in the middle if I go too early. Understand that? So I'm here. So you're telling me, go. Now I can go. You're coming across with me. I've got to get, go. Second trap. Understand? So I'm defending short middle, because the ball's gone over, I'm defending short middle. He comes out, I've still got to defend here, not let anyone come in the short middle. I bump, and then I go to the second one. Because what most teams will try and do, lag pass, straight down the middle. Bang, kick it in the middle, beating it. So we hold, because at the end of the day, has that hurt us? How many seconds are on the shot clock? Maybe five. They're under a little bit of time pressure now. So I'm here waiting, get the bump. Now I'm going and I've got to sprint across to get the second. So let's have a look at that. Okay, remember, we can't beat them at the moment. We're just teaching the principles. Here we go. And you go. Talk, wait. Push with the sideline. Go get it a little bit quicker. Got defending. What are you looking at? Good. Lag pass. Wait, wait, hell. What are you going to get him across? Come and get him. Come and get him. Go get him. Good job. Okay, did you bump him out of court? Coach, did he bump him out of court? He did? Awesome. Okay, because that's one thing even the junior tall blacks, even the junior tall blacks often forget to do. Take the guard out. You don't want the guard back. I mean, within the rules of the game, take the guard out. But bump him straight out of court, then rotate, go. Go get the trap. And stop. Cool. Okay, where does he now go? He goes to the line, the circle below the ball. So now he's got to go back to the circle below the ball and rotate out with his hand like this. Okay, so he's rotating back. The reason we use the circles is as a teaching point. As they get better at it, they'll get the angles better, but often they want to go straight here and it's an easy pass, rip and go. So let's just work on that. Let's go. 
You're allowed to talk to you. You're allowed to get a little bit more aggressive and get excited about the press. Okay, what is the principle of the press? My main man here. What's the principle of this press? Talk to me. Oh, God, the coach is talking to me. Okay, what's the green all about? Slowing the ball down the court. Outstanding. What are we trying to get if we get a trap in the back court? Eight seconds. What are we trying to get? Where are we, where's the, where are we allowing the ball to go? Behind the... And sideways. Awesome. Here we go. Go, wait, wait. Go get him, go get him, go get him. Good. Leg, turn it, wait for him. Okay, wait, hesitate at him. Pump him out, go. And where are you going? Yep, line below. Where are you going? He needs to go. We're not interested in him. He's allowed to throw the ball there. We're not interested in him. Get back there. Are we interested in him? Is he behind that line? Is it going to hurt us? And he throws it back there. Cool. Michelle, can you do eight seconds? Uh, just put the shot clock on for me. Here we go again. Sorry, rotations. Offense. Middle. So the offensive player goes to the middle. Middle goes to the side. Side goes to the opposite side. Then we go out. Got it? Here we go. Go. Oh. Yep. No, keep going, keep going. Good job, good job. Rotate. So you're the handler now, that's right. Yep, awesome. I can, should I can't even see. Oh. Okay, go again. My bad, we're just trying to get the shot clock. Okay, so eight seconds. Think first eight in defense. Okay, put a little bit of pressure. Let's go. Go. Wait, wait, wait. Go. Get a trap, get a trap, get a trap, good trap, good trap, go, rotate it. Ah, 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 ah. Okay, try it again. He's not your buddy. Ready? Go. Wait, wait, no, 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 do. Hold, stop. Okay, you are beautiful and big. I love it. But if I stand like this, Anyone can see. If I suddenly go wide and long, get down in defensive stance, I become very effective. Yep, let's try it again. Go. Wide, get down in defensive stance. Stop. Okay, so your angle, remember, you're coming in here, come round, and now I'm coming in to get him. Get nice and wide. We're not going to jump at him, though, eh? Because if I jump at him, he's got, just going to rip and go. Okay? Close him out long. Go again. Good job. You guys are talking, eh? What are you going to tell him? I got sideline. Bring him in. What are you going to say? Yeah, I got help. Let's go. Rotate. Hands, hands. Go get him, go get him. A little far. Good. Rotate out of there. Bump him. Oh, stop, stop. It's osmosis, say. Eh? I know you guys have got this thing going, eh? That you just know, but you've got to talk to him. Yeah? you got to say, as he's coming, where do you think you could release him? Maybe release him here to go. Okay, let's see if we can get him a little bit higher in the trap. Ready? Go. Go get him. Go get him. Go get him. Good. Good. Rotate. Wait. Come and get him. Bring him over. Bring him over. There it is. Good. Nice job. Rotate. Let's go. Go, wait, stop, stop. Okay, you have to keep him out of the middle. If your angle is, get the ball there. If you are below him here, what do you think he's going to do? He's seeing that coming, eh? No, 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 come back here, honey. Awesome. Okay, he's seeing that. So if I'm here, what do you think he might do on me? If he's smart, he's going to rip back on me. So where's my angle? I'm going to be my head on that shoulder. Go, go, come get him. Come get him, come get him, come get him, come get him. Get the trap. Yep. Okay, try it again. Go get him, go get him. Good. Rotate. Send him. Come get him, come get him. Good job. That's right. It's my um, shot clock. We all have trouble with shot clock people. Okay, where are you running? 
Lying below with your hand like this. Why is your hand like that? What are you defending there, do you think? What's that called? We've got short middle, deep middle. Okay, I promise you, and I've seen Coach Green do it, if you run with your hand like this in the lane, 20 bucks it'll hit it at some stage. Someone will throw the ball into it. Okay, rotate again, let's go. Here we go, here we go, get aggressive. Angle, angle, go get him, go get him, go get him. Good, 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 rotate out. Wait, send, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Did he tell you to go? You cannot go till he releases you. Go again. Can the reason that is, I have to say internationally, when we were in China, we got smacked a couple of times against Slovenia by it. They worked out our um, green press and our guys weren't holding and they were just smacking it straight into the middle. We got some really good steals out of it in our first game. Second game, they hurt us a little bit because we've missed our rotation here. So this is critical that you can't release him. You can't, you've got to release him. Go now, and you've got to make a decision as I'm coming sprinting back to here, yep, go. So he can go, and now I'm coming across, and I'm being the next. Okay, here we go, good job. Go. Good, stop, rotate, go. Here we go, go get him, go get him. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, good job. Can you, uh, just on it, let's have a look and see how many, what the time is when we stop to here. So we get first trap, second trap. Let's see what our time is, go. Good. Rotate. Okay, stop. Eight seconds. Nice job. Where should you have gone? Nope. Line, the circle below the line of the ball. See this little guy here? I have a feeling he's an amazing handler. Did you let him in court or did you let him out of court? Okay, so you went from here. Did you have a little bump of him? Great job. Okay, let's go this time the opposite side. Get over the opposite side, honey. Ready? Go. Okay, stop. Which way is your backside facing? Okay. You don't have to go right to the middle, but you're defending short middle. So you're looking for anything coming in here, anything coming here, because you're going to go get it. This is a critical area. Yep. Try it again. Good. Push him out. Yeah, you got him out. Let him go. Go get him. Good. Outstanding. But which way is your hand going? How's your hand going? You're running like this, eh? Right to here. If someone's in here, what are you going to tell them to do? Get out. Okay, what are you defending now? Deep middle. Okay, one more. Go. Good. Pass back. Bump out. Go. Send them. And stop. Okay, here, as he's dribbling, you can have a little hedge at him. Just to push him over. Yeah? Okay, back in. Okay, let's get one more person. So let's have a person in the middle. Two here. And one here. Okay, let's have three offences, players. Have the guard. Cool. Let's put someone at halfway. Weak side. Okay, same rotations. Except this time you bump down to there to go out. So it's exactly the same. No, no, sorry. Defensively, weak side will bump down. So you're going to go across to there on the rotation. Cool. Here we go. Right in. Go. Go get him, go get him, go get him, go get him. Good. Okay, stop, good. Okay, at any stop, nice job. At any time, you can run into the middle. Any time. You can go a little bit behind if you want, but you can run into the middle and they can try and get the ball to you. Okay, what are you defending? Caleb, isn't it? You're defending short middle. Here we go. Wait, wait, wait. Go get him, go get him. Good, good, good. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, stop. Backside facing, so you can see him. Go again. Stay sideline, stay sideline, just for now. 
Go get him. Good. Good. Go get him. No, 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 no. Where should you be going? Straight down to the middle. And what are you going to do? Bump him. The ball goes just drop back into the middle. Okay, let's go again. Come into the middle. I want you to get the ball right here. What's your name? Tiger, tiger, tiger. Get the ball here, honey. Okay, it's your job. Get the ball here. You let him get it there, you're in trouble. Yeah? Cool. Go. Go. Rotate, rotate. Wait, 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 wait. Go get him. Go, go, go. Be aggressive. Be aggressive. Don't try. No steal. Good. Go. Nice job. Wait. Okay, so where are you going now? So this guy's gone to the middle. You gotta go back through. So go back and come out. Yeah, and come get him. Good job. Actually, Tiger, my bad. Get the ball about the red line. Go! About the red line. Good. Good. Wait. Rotate. About the red line. Hold it. Hold it. Go, go, go. Ah, sprint! Oh, dude, dude. Where are you sprinting to? Okay, sprint. Is this short middle? What is your job coming from there? To fend short middle. So here, they throw it. I promise you, stick your hand out, but you've got to sprint, hey? Go again, one more. Go. Wait, 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 go get him. Good, now go, adjust. Go get him. Good, leg pass, nice job. 14 seconds, we're happy. 14 seconds, go into your offense. Um, come back on the baseline, please. Awesome job. Um, I'm not gonna go any further than that because we have more rotations, but the key things, guys, come and sit down over here in front of the board. Um, the critical things are know where the trap zones are, understand short middle and deep middle. The stats that um, Coach Green and I have done is they will try and throw the ball 86% of the time to short middle. They will try and throw 10% sideline. The other 4% we really don't care. It's usually a diagonal long pass that we can defend. Okay, the other thing they do is throw lags all the time, and we're really happy if they throw lags because it's all about first eight, second eight, getting them late into the offense so they feel uncomfortable. And what we do, um, what we've been trying to do is throwing something different at them coming out of it. So those are just the key principles that we've got in our press, and it doesn't change if we run white or black. It all ends up the same. But white, we push the corners, and we look for a quick steal. And it's usually off a fast break layer or a really nice rim touch because the team will often throw it out and want to get it in quickly and we're riding up on them. So that's our white press. And our black is just a big man, which we line up with the big man press. Um, any questions? Oh, awesome. That means I've done an outstanding job. No. Um, but I've got some notes. They're handwritten. And if you want them, it's got all of this information on it. Okay, but you've got to remember, give something. Back pass, side pass, easy to defend. Force long diagonals, because guys can go and get it and girls can go and get it. Yep, hey, great job, guys. Outstanding sitting there for two and a half hours, eh? Hey, thank you very much. I'm... No questions? Thanks. Thanks, Diz.